you're getting that fluid to to move up. I sort of see that as the plasma that you're showing in that in that tube. Yeah. Right. If we don't move that, what's going to happen? It's just going to go. Multiple studies have shown that brain cohesion is increased at six breaths a minute or less. Mm. Multiple MRI studies have shown that there's increased sort of connect connection between different parts of the brain, that there's increased brain cohesion uh, at six breaths uh, a minute or less when, you know, and, and, there's a lot of studies that have looked at inducing altered states of consciousness, uh, One cycle, breath, yeah. breath cycle. And so that's two and a half breaths a minute alters, you know, alters states of, 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 of consciousness. When you activate your perennial floor, you're bringing in, you're, you're, you're using the, the musculature of your perineum as a sort of, as a, a almost like a, 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 a an, an ignition of the fluid up towards your cranium. So you're actually squeezing the pelvic floor, you're squeezing the sacrum and getting that fluid. We have a fluid, you know, we have a fluid sort of lake down at the bottom of the sacrum. You're getting that fluid to, to move up. I sort of see that as the plasma that you're showing in that, in that tube, yeah. right? If we don't move that, what's going to happen? It's just going to go, right? So now imagine that you're, that, that now is you know, I swallow that, right? And it goes into my spine. And so the bottom there is the bottom of my spine. That's the sacrum, okay? And the black is my third ventricle, okay? So how could I get, obviously our bodies isn't glass, but you know, you could, if it wasn't glass and it was more malleable like our bodies are, you could have somebody, you know, take a little bit of a, you know, squeeze the bottom and all of a sudden you start seeing that plasma 